Hi, my name is Claude White, and I tell you, just when you think people can't be any more stupid, they prove you wrong every time. And just harping on that theme, I'm going to talk about one, Le'Veon Bell, the former Pittsburgh Steeler and now New York Jet, and what happened to him on May 25th. This was actually reported yesterday. This is according to the New York Post. Um, on May 25th at his Hollywood, Florida home, uh, Le'Veon Bell invited two quote-unquote girlfriends over. Um, he had left to go to practice, left them in, in his house. And when he came back, um, his place was ransacked and um, they vanished with over $500,000. Yes, over a half a million worth of jewelry. And that included... A Black Panther pendant studded with black and white diamonds, two gold chains with diamonds, and, of course, a Rolex. Now, folks, first of all, you know good and damn well those were not Le'Veon Bell's girlfriends. And um, we have a term for that. Le'Veon Bell, let's call it what it is. He got trick rolled, okay? And he he was stupid. He thought it was flossing. I'm Le'Veon Bell. I'm gonna have a menage of Le'Veon. Have two chicks. Listen, he's single, you do what you do. But dude, you stupid enough to leave them in the house and have your jewelry there? Hey, stupid. Safe deposit box, okay? Or better still, ladies, time to go. You see, this falls under being sandbag. And sand is an acronym for simp ass nigga department. And they got a bag off of his shit. Now, I'm pretty sure that Le'Veon Bell has this insured and he'll recoup this money but he's so goddamn stupid he deserved what he got and I don't feel bad for him and I hope that those ladies you know what God bless him and I do hope they get caught but you know what Le'Veon Bell deserves what he gets I feel nothing for him this is what happens ladies and gentlemen when simping goes wrong Please like and subscribe. This is Claude White. And again, take care and God bless.